What's your problem? Bored? Stop whining and watch a fight. Not just a fight, pretty much every MMA fight worth watching. How? UFC Fight Pass, that's how. It's a digital streaming service with the world's largest fight library, original shows, and exclusive live events. That's thousands of fights being through your eyeballs and into your brain. Anywhere, anytime. Problem solved. UFC Fight Pass solves everything. The biggest rivalry in MMA is back on April 23rd. Here we go! As John Jones returns, dead set on reclaiming the title. He is a monster! From new light heavyweight champion, Daniel Cormier. Are you kidding me? Oh! Plus, the UFC's first and only flyweight champion, Demetrius Johnson, faces undefeated Henry Cejudo. It's a championship doubleheader at the MGM Grand, April 23rd. Tickets on sale now at Ticketmaster.com. Before an epic night of fights, here we go! UFC 196 starts here on FS1. It's a must win. Wow. Welterweight war. Wow. Brandon Thatch battles Sia Bahadurzada. Just vicious. Plus, <laughs> Eric Silva thrusts back into the spotlight to challenge Nordin Taleb. UFC 196 prelims tomorrow at 6.30 Eastern on FS1. fans, it's great to be back in Las Vegas as we welcome you to the official weigh-ins for UFC 196, McGregor versus Diaz. Tomorrow night, only on pay-per-view, the notorious Conor McGregor, the UFC's undisputed featherweight champion, will once again enter the octagon on a search and destroy mission when he collides with Nate Diaz. Also tomorrow night on pay-per-view, our co-headliner features newly crowned UFC bantamweight champion, Holly Holm. She looks to defend her belt for the first time against perennial contender, Misha Tate. We'd like to send out a special welcome to our UFC Fight Club members and thank our UFC sponsors. Bud Light, raise one to right now. Metro PCS, where you get nationwide coverage on the blazing fast, 4G LTE T-Mobile Network for just $30, period. Harley Davidson, the only motorcycle worthy of being in the octagon. Roll your own. And by EA Sports UFC 2, which hit stores on March 15th with the mode for every fight fan and more than 250 licensed fighters to help you finish the fight in a big way. Pre-order your copy now at easports.com slash UFC. And now to get the official weigh-ins for UFC 196 underway, here is Joe Rogan. What's up, my friends? Welcome to the weigh-ins. Ariane, Brittany, Vanessa, and Chrissy. Dana White, without him, none of this will be possible. Joe Silva, best. On the planet Earth, Bruce Buffer, the voice of the Octagon, Lorenzo Fratina. Without him, we would not be here. We got a banging card for you folks. We're going to kick it off in the flyweight division. Live on UFC Fight Pass, Julian Erosa versus Teruto Ishihara.
from Mr. Guimaraes. And his opponent, Vitor Miranda. Five and a half. One eighty-five and a half for Mr. Miranda. Marcelo Grimores and Vitor Miranda, ladies and gentlemen. The next fight takes place in the welterweight division. Eric Silva versus Nordin.
134. 134.
I kept visualizing the victory. Oh my God. I really believed I could do it. Everything we trained for happened, and everything we worked on worked. Beautiful, and she's beautiful. She's hurt. She's hurt. Able to have that victory and make it all pay off is just, there's no feeling like it. I don't ever want to fight for money. I don't ever want to fight for fame. I'm fighting for passion. So let's get a fight going. It's that simple. Oh! I'm undefeated for the past two years, and I've been taking every single person they put in front of me out. Holly's a fantastic fighter. Being a multiple world champion in boxing and kickboxing, she's just a phenomenal striker. But I don't think she's as well-rounded as I am, and I don't think that she's as battle-tested as I am. And I know for sure she's never fought anyone like me. She's gonna be a different fighter than Rhonda was. We're working on everything. She's a scrapper, she's a scrambler, she's unpredictable. Beautiful. She's not afraid to push the pace, and that makes her a very tough opponent. I pose a big threat to her. She knows as well as I do that this is going to be a really big challenge for her. I had my eye broken in the first round with Sarah McMahon, and I still came back to win that fight. I've been dropped with head kicks and still come back to win fights. You have to literally put me away, or I'm coming back for you. Whatever is the moment to capitalize on, I just want to capitalize on it. That belt is symbolic of all that energy and all that passion and all that love and all that drive. Everything that I've done over the past decade has led to this moment and I'm supposed to be the world champion. Winning, winning the belt, that's the best part. But I don't want to stop there. I want to be a reigning champion and that's the goal. Tomorrow's your big night. Give us your thoughts. I'm excited. Thank you all so much for being here. Women's MMA rocks. Thank you so much. It's because of you guys. Seriously, it's because of you guys that I stand here right now. So thank you. Good luck to you, ma'am. We'll see you tomorrow night. Misha Tate, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here with the champ. Holly Holm. Holly, what has this been like? and give us your thoughts on Misha as a challenger for tomorrow night. A whole new training camp, whole new nerves, a whole new fight, whole new work in progress, you know. November's fight was back in November. Um, I gotta be ready for March 5th, so I'm ready. Good luck to you, ma'am. See you tomorrow night. The champion, ladies and gentlemen, Holly Holm!
Now let's take a closer look at the two men involved in the main event of the evening. Connor doesn't care. Connor says, I will fight anybody, anytime, in any way. At 27 years of age, with every record in the book, with weight divisions above, ready for me to go at, every other champion gets a belt and they don't want to go up, or they don't want to go down. I'm going straight up. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Nate Diaz! Conor McGregor, you're taking everything I work for, I'm going to fight your ass. You know what's the real fight, what's the real money fight is me. Well, this is sitting to Sports Center. Rafael Dos Anjos has withdrawn from next week's UFC 196 lightweight title fight against Conor McGregor. All right, Dana, uh, the show will go on. So who is McGregor going to fight? BJ Penn wanted the fight. Um, Anthony Pettis wanted this fight. A lot of guys wanted this fight, but he will fight Nate Diaz. We felt this was the fight to make and the fight that the fans wanted to see. Conor McGregor is moving from 145 pounds to 170 pounds. I don't give a f I don't give a f either. F you. F you. F you. I don't give a f you, you knocked out three midgets and you're pumped up. All midgets. I fought every week forever. I've been in the UFC forever fighting everybody. Your bitch ass belt too. The belt. I don't give a about the belt. The only thing I give a about is the check. And my check super heavy. There is no games in this. I'm just simply the best fighter, and that's it. He will be KO'd inside the fourth round. It's another day for me. One pulls out, another one steps in. I'm used to it. I was just giggling at his little soft body. I, I, I've never seen a skinny guy. How can a fat guy be so skinny at the same time? I've never, 
It's, it amuses me, but um, I'm looking forward to go in there, put the martial arts back into the game. Weight should never be an issue. Champions should be able to go up and down and fight any chance that uh, comes before them. So I'm looking forward to go in tomorrow night fresh and put on a show for the fans because, you know, the fans are part. I, I, I always step up for the fans. I can't wait to see it, sir. Good luck to you. Conor McGregor, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all very much. We will see you tomorrow. UFC fans, tonight at 6 p.m., come on up to the Buffalo Wild Wings at the Miracle Mile Shops to meet former UFC middleweight champion Chris Weidman and get the chance to play the new EA Sports UFC 2 game prior to its release on March 15th. Get a picture, get an autograph, and get entered to win a pair of tickets to UFC 196 tomorrow night. That's 6 p.m. tonight at the B-Dubs Miracle Mile location brought to you by EA Sports UFC 2 and Buffalo Wild Wings. Conversation on Twitter. Use hashtag UFC196 to unlock a special Twitter emoji. UFC Fight Pass is your home for all new live events and original programming. March gives fight fans more exclusive debuts than ever before. Check out 2020 for your fix of facts, figures, and little known trivia from recent bouts. Break down the science behind mixed martial arts in UFC Lab. Relive the best of Vitor Belfort and pioneers of MMA. Hear incredible stories from UFC stars. Vanessa Silva can't deny me a battle shot. In fightography and stream featured bouts on UFC Fight Pass early prelims. This month, the nightmare returns as Diego Sanchez takes on Jim Miller at UFC 196. And later in the month, Abel Trujillo and Ross Pearson go to war live from Brisbane. Plus exclusive live action from around the world, including Pancras, Invicta, Titan and more. And the UFC Fight Pass On Demand library keeps on growing with the addition of Glory Kickboxing and Eddie Bravo Invitational. Stay tuned all month long. This is what UFC looks like. This is what swagger, family, power, and belief look like. Get it? So get it. Shop UFCstore.com for the all-new UFC Fight Kits by Reebok. 
ufcstore.com. This is what UFC looks like. I am calm, cold, moodless, and ready to take out the body that's in front of me. I will be a ghost in there. He will think I'm there, and then I am not there. I will strike him with every limb, the knee, the heel, the fist, the elbow. I recognize a weak target, and I shut the lights out. They go down as the greatest of all time. You need to put them away in devastating fashion every single time. It's my time to shine.